Hi, it's uh, Nick Pushak again. I wanted to show you some of the uh, navigation and mapping features on the Tesla. So here we go. A little bit about the navigation system. Uh, one nice new feature uh, when you're either at home and going to work or at work going to home, if you simply just slide the navigation to the right, it senses that I guess I have to go to work now and uh, selects work automatically maps, of course, uh, your destination. If I cancel that, and um, the other option is just to click once on the navigation, you get home and work at the top, which is very convenient, and then all of your recent uh, locations, which is very convenient. So very easy, quick access. Favorite, I guess, are your most uh, commonly searched uh, places, and uh, navigation is pretty nice. I do have to uh, say that the uh, navigation um, is not quite as good as Google Maps. Uh, I look at my phone sometimes if I'm in a real big rush uh, to uh, go somewhere because sometimes it can pick a quicker uh, path. Um, I believe it's using um, a uh, a built-in navigation on a cloud-based navigation system uh, and I read that that is because uh, it wanted to make sure the navigation system worked if you did not have internet access uh, the T-Mobile internet which I think is what the internet is into the car um, is a little spotty in places I don't think there is worldwide or nationwide coverage as some of the other uh, cellular companies. Um, I really wish they would have uh, gone with Google Maps, uh, but it's not too bad. It just doesn't pick uh, the best route. It is using um, uh, traffic. I do use the mapping system for traffic, and of course, um, you can zoom in, zoom out with just pinch. Uh, one of my friends saw me do that yesterday. <laughs> he was quite impressed. I guess I've just gotten used to it. Um, and so that's a little bit about the navigation. The other thing up here, that's a handy, nice new feature. Um, uh, it will do a trip. Um, it toggles you between tr trip, north, south, and uh, in the direction that you're going. Uh, this basically makes sure that your whole route is visible, uh, whereas this year full route might not be visible. That's a nice new feature they added. And then if you just touch once, you'll get some other options here showing uh, charge charging places um, and traffic. And then the world, which I don't use too often. You don't really need the plus or minus because you can pinch. So you can see the date is a little slow. Uh, draws uh, the data so the download is a little slow it's not instantaneous like on your phone with uh, Google Maps but I'm not complaining at all and if you're just interested the car has been driving by itself in autopilot uh, this whole time uh, it's uh, this is my commute down a highway, uh, about 20 minutes down a highway, and I get 20 minutes to do something every day. I'm going to try to get off at this exit here. Lane change by itself. It doesn't do a lane change off of the highway, so here I'm trying to do a lane change off the highway. It won't do it. I have to take over. Take care.